New testimony today in the trial for the man accused of killing Cash App founder Bob Lee and the defendant's sister has been making serious waves with her claims on the witness stand. Lauren Toms is a CBS News Bay Area reporter and she is following the case from San Francisco and joins me now to talk about this. So Lauren, remind us again who Bob Lee was and why this case is getting so much national attention. Yeah, hey there. Bob Lee was known for his role as a tech executive here in Silicon Valley, and he's known for his role in founding the popular money exchange app Cash App, as well for his role in founding JavaScript and Android. And at the time of this stabbing in April of last year, it sent shockwaves through not only San Francisco experiencing public safety issues at the time, but across the country, as Elon Musk even tweeted about this case, that violent crime in San Francisco was rampant and at the time he questioned whether city officials were doing enough in this case. Now, an arrest was made nine days after the stabbing took place and since then we've learned more details about the tech underworld and the drugs and partying that goes on. We have also learned since the trial began last week about the murder weapon, a seven and a half inch Joseph Joseph paring knife that prosecutors say the accused Nima Momeni grabbed from his sister's apartment just minutes before the stabbing. Now, the defense has maintained that their client, Nima Momeni, acted in self defense and had to stand his ground after they say Bob Lee attacked him in a fit of rage brought on by several days of drug use. They've suggested that it could have been Bob Lee who was holding the murder weapon. Now, the prosecution has painted Nima Momeni as an overprotective brother who was uh, questioning Bob Lee about a potential assault that may have happened at the hands who Bob Lee introduced his sister to just days before all of this took place. Now, we are learning more about drug use that took place in the hours leading up to the stabbing, including cocaine and ketamine and the potential motive, that alleged assault that once again took place at the hands of a man who Bob Lee introduced Nima Momeni's sister, Kazar, to, she says, just days before the stabbing. Uh, all right, Lauren Toms reporting for us from uh, the Bay Area. Thank you, Lauren. Really important story. Glad you're on it.